everybody, Pete here at the Golf Paradigm and the Golf Underground. Uh, inflammation is a big detriment to golfers in particular, not only for your game, but in, in your life. And it inhibits your practice, it inhibits your play, it makes life more uh, less tolerable, gives you a lot of pain. So it's widely known among a lot of health professionals that inflammation comes out of your gut, i.e. what you eat. So today I want to give you a real easy uh, breakfast that you can make, whether you're short on time and you got to get to the first tee, or you're really looking to in reduce that inflammation in your body so that you can play and practice more. And what I mean by that is if you ever uh, take a, a handful of oats, a uh, handful of wheat, if you put it, soak it in water and then take it out and set it on a counter, and you put the equal amount of dry oats or wheat next to it, you'll notice that as that grain absorbs that water, it swells. Well, it does the same thing in your intestinal tract and in your gut, hence the inflammation in the rest of your body. So what I have here is an alternative to that, and it, uh, it's a nut breakfast. Uh, you can look up Charles Pollock and uh, meat nut breakfast that went viral. This is a little twist on that. Uh, and so you can do it in as simple as five ingredients. You can take any kind of nuts you want, pecans, almonds, walnuts. In this instance, I'm gonna try Brazil nuts and macadamia nuts. So you take a food processor like this, smaller one, take a handful of nuts and drop them in. Take a handful of the secondary nut and drop those in. Add just a little more. And then you go ahead and you blend that up. They're all nice and ground. Then you add your banana, just break it up, it makes it a little faster. Add Saigon cinnamon. Now this cinnamon is a little stronger than normal cinnamon, the odor, the taste, and everything because it has more essential oils in it. Uh, so you add that to taste. I usually go around in a circle or so. And then the last ingredient would be coconut milk. Uh, you can get regular coconut milk if you really want to uh, uh, reduce your sugar intake. Um, this one happens to be vanilla, it's just a little tastier. You can work your way up to elimination of any flavoring. You just shake that up and you add it for texture. You don't need very much, I would say a uh, couple uh, tablespoons. And of course you put your lid back on, line it all up, it takes about a minute or so. add it to any bowl and as you can see it has a very similar texture to oatmeal or cream wheat and it probably tastes a lot better uh, if you want to just top it off a little bit you throw it in the microwave for about 20 or 30 seconds garnish it with blueberries or raspberries and you're off to the golf course easy as that thanks for joining